Hey, I'm gonna show you how to make a Kanye West type song. Okay, Kanye West, aka Kanye Amari West. Thought he would have a different name from his rapper one, but okay. Born in Atlanta, raised in Chicago. Kanye showed interest in the arts in the third grade and started selling beats to local artists at the age of 13. He also wrote songs that had his first one recorded at a studio. It was titled Green Eggs and Ham. Shortly after, he crossed paths with a producer named No ID, who soon became his mentor. He actually was the one who showed Kanye how to sample after getting his first sampler. After producing for countless artists, he would finally get his big break when he signed to Rockefeller Records. And even then, he wasn't able to be looked at as an artist. They still wanted him in his producer lane. Because at the time, the only artists that were out right there, it was gangster artists. They didn't really see any money in just anything. Because at the time, the only thing that was profitable was gangster artists. So they wasn't really willing to take a chance on anybody else. It took the label head Dame Dash to take a chance on him. And after that, he dropped College Dropout, which one of the singles hit number 15 on the Hot 100. Okay, inspiration. For this track, I'm going to be referring to songs like Monster, Black Skin Head, and Blood on the Leaves. Because I wanted to go more towards that aggressive Kanye sound. I'll explain more of this later. Okay, ingredients. To make a Kanye West style beat, you had to have vocal samples as your main melody. Sampling became a style when he was coming up. He was known for the high pitched vocal samples. Having a lot of percussion helps too, mostly like African drums. So what we need is vocal samples, boomy drums, percussion, like you know the African stuff. Random vocal chops because in some of his songs it's just, it, it just be at the oddest points. It's just a random like scream like ah gonna sprinkle some of that in there and distort it 808s because he likes to rage sometimes and that's where that aggressive Kanye sound comes from okay melody for the melody I found this vocal sample in one of my sample packs I didn't do too much to it all I did was EQ out the low so it doesn't mess with the 808 <laughs> Okay, drum time. For the drums, I added a lot of distortion and a lot of compression. I was trying to replicate the drums from Black Skinhead, so I came up with this pattern. All right, hi-hats. I used a triplet pattern to match the groove of the flow I'm gonna be rapping with. Alright, percussion. For the percussion, I found this bongo sample and I sped it up to match the tempo. For the 808, I distorted it with the capitator and gave it this pattern. Vocal chops. For these vocal chops, I had to search through YouTube to find some of them. I didn't really have any choir samples in my sample pack, so I chopped them up and repitched them. Then I added the old Kanye vocal chops from Life of Pablo, the Street Fighter ones, just to give it that sonic boom. Okay, we got all that down, so here's the finished beat. Now it's time for the boss. Well, Kanye's rap style was literally all over the place. 
you can be going this way one song and going this way the other song so that's why I'm only referencing three songs that kind of have the similar have a similar you know rap style and with that rap style he's always rapping about biblical references like you know comparing himself to God Jesus calling himself Jesus Cain and Abel oh, throw all that in there always talking about race because you know his father was a formal black panther so i think that's where that comes from and also yeah I, I think that's where that comes from you gotta rap about pop culture whether it be like tv shows uh movies celebrities just throw anything in there if, if a celebrity names rhymes with your rhyme scheme throw it in there being slave to the media or record labels because that's his new thing now. He feels like he's slave to the record label, which isn't so out of the question because some of the record labels, they do got slave deals. So, yeah. And uh, being sexually explicit because uh, I don't know if you guys remembered on that Father Stretch My Hand song, he's talking about some bleaching buttholes or something. Oh, that's Kanye for you. Okay, ad-libs. For the ad-libs, Kanye doesn't really even have ad-libs. The most I heard him, the most ad-libs I heard on a song from him was on that song Facts, but he was just doing the A flow that, you know, they got from Jumpman with Drake and shit. Yeah, he was just doing that. Okay. Okay, we're almost there. We just gotta come up with some phrases with that information and make some lines and catch phrases out of all of them. I'm gonna call the song Ghetto Slaves because, you know, he likes to call himself enslaved, so the record labels are gonna enslave him. But he feels like if he's gonna be a slave, he's not gonna be the most obedient one, so he's gonna be a ghetto slave. Yeah, it's important to have clever wordplay and like bend words, words that don't really seem like they can rhyme, but if you stretch them far enough, Kanye will make that joint rhyme. Okay, it's song time. guys there you go how to make a Kanye type song you know like comment and subscribe do all that uh, make sure you hit the bell notification so you never miss a video yeah I'm trying to get the joint pop and share this joint with your friends please uh, I'm uploading every week so yeah make sure you stick around because I got that Meek Mill coming next and um yeah stay healthy uh keep moving and this song will be in the link below so if you want to go check out the full song and listen to it by yourself by all means go do that also my original music is in the link below so yeah give that a listen um 
stay healthy, uh, keep moving, and um, do something. Part of my language, I just can't stand who I'm chained with. Back on the slave ship, these diamonds are rocking me ancient. She getting anxious, she spreading her water and waist flip. Clapped in my day shift, to feel like I'm on a plantation.